And what is your name? Sydney. Sydney? Okay. Ma'am, I replaced your first burger free because it didn't taste right to you. And the second burger because it wasn't cooked enough. Now you're telling me this burger is burnt? You got to be kidding me. Where do you think you are? This is McDonald's. We ain't serving no sirloin steak. 525 an hour and I gotta put up with the likes of you. I'll tell you what, why don't you come back here, take my greasy apron and my stupid ugly hat, stand back here in 128 degrees temperature and cook your own burger till you're satisfied. Oh, and hey, don't forget you gotta smile nice for all the customers while you're sweating to death and the French fry boys are whispering perverted jokes. No, it doesn't sound like a good old time to you? Well then I highly suggest you take that little burger back to your table, eat it, and think about how lucky you are I didn't smush an apple pie in your face. Have I made myself clear? Thank you, have a nice day. <laughs> Sid or Sydney? Sid. Okay, so I want to make sure I write this right. Is that you there? Okay, perfect. I had a, I spelled it wrong up here. Just ignore that. I wanted to say, first of all, I loved your costume. I loved how that played in to what you were already doing. Very good. And I think you had a really good understanding of your script and your stage presence. I could tell that you knew exactly what you were going to do and exactly where you were going to go with it. I think that the one thing that would have bumped it up a little bit more is if you let yourself go a little bit more angry and then pulled it back, you know? But I think you you gave us that all the way up. You got a little bit more upset, a little bit more upset, a little bit more upset, and then you got really nice in the end, which is what they would have to do. And so that was perfect. Good job. Who else would like to go? Okay, um, I'll just pick you.